My name is Sophia. Welcome to the USA Test Prep Classroom. We are going to learn about addition. Can you say addition? Great job. When we add things, we are finding the total number or the sum. Can you say sum? Excellent. We can add groups to find a sum. When finding a sum, we are finding out how many things there are all together. Can you say all together? Perfection. Let's head outside to learn more about adding. Follow me. What a beautiful day. Hey, look, we can use these flowers to learn about addition. We have three groups of flowers here, red, yellow, and purple. Let's count the flowers in each group. Count the purple flowers with me. Ready? One, two. Great job. Now let's count the yellow. Here we go. One, two, three, four. Yes. Finally, the red. One, two, three. Nice. Let's add these groups. First, let's add the two smallest groups, the red and the purple flowers. To find the sum of these groups, we can count up. We know we have three red flowers, so we will count up from three as we add the purple. Ready? Three, four, five. Excellent. You just found the sum of three plus two. Since we know the sum of the red and purple, we can now add in the yellow to find how many flowers there are all together. We will count up from five since we know the sum of the red and purple is five. Ready? Five, six, seven, eight, nine. Super! You just figured out there are nine flowers in all by using addition. First, we added two plus three to get five. Next, we added five plus four to get nine. Now you know two plus three plus four equals nine. You are a fast learner. This has been fun. Let's head back to the USA Test Prep classroom to wrap up. Follow me. I had a great time today learning about addition. Remember, when we add things, we are finding the total number or the sum. Think about different ways to add the next time you want to find the sum of groups. Thanks for joining me. See ya.